a busy corner, was taken into custody by police. And now the prosecutor's office confirming that they're investigating because this was some sort of police chase. I heard a crash and I came outside when I came outside I saw that right there. The crash happened near the corner of University and Market in Newark right next to Essex County Community College as the workday was starting. A Jeep plowing into a red car pushing it into the sidewalk and a gated fence. Were police pursuing the Jeep? Yes, it seemed like when it happened so they came from everywhere. The driver of the Jeep that was in the Jeep he got out and tried to run and that was that was all I seen. Then I saw, I saw him cut the top off the car. I the red him, car. The red car. I saw him take two people out. The red car so mangled, the jaws of life had to be used to get the people inside out. Investigators are still gathering evidence to determine exactly what happened, but witnesses say they believe the Jeep was stolen. I'm tired of the stolen cars. I'm tired of our young youth doing things they have no business doing. The prosecutor's office had told me initially they were involved, but as you were listening to our story, I just got a call and they said that this was not a homicide, so they have been pulled from the case. But I also can tell you that several police officers were also injured. We'll have more for you later on. We're live in Newark, New Jersey. Christine Sloan, CBS 2 News.